Okay, here, here we go, second batch. Um, so this is my second of my palm free tests. The first one was a little more coconut. No, first one was a little less coconut and a little more castor. This one's a little more coconut. No, that's not right. One of them has more coconut and less castor. One has more castor and less coconut. And I am basically just testing for lather and bar texture and bar hardness with that tweak. Um, so we'll just see how it works out. I mean, there might not be any perceptible difference at all, so we'll just have to see. Okay. Come on now. in the first video about my milk mix. I mean, if you guys have been here for a while, I know some of you have, I go back and forth all the time about the kind of milks that I like to use. Now, I had finally settled on coconut and cream and goat milk. I like the goat milk just because it is so super fatty. Even in the can, it has more fat than, or in the powder can, there's more fat um, than there is in the, in the, um, the liquid can, so I really just kind of like the goat milk for the super fat that it brings, um, just that extra luxury of the extra oil that you put in there. And for the liquid milk, I had been doing half coconut and half cream. Well, since I made that decision, everything under the sun that could go wrong with coconut milk has gone wrong. The store has been out of stock, I can't find the right kind, I buy a low fat version instead of the regular fat version, I finally find the right one and I use it once and it turns solid, it gets soft, uh, when I put it into ice cubes it gets frost bitten in the freezer really quick. And then today I ran out of coconut oil so I ran to the store to get a can of coconut oil and what did I forget? The coconut milk. So I think that... Um, I never have these problems with the cream. I am not much of a milk drinker, but I always have cream in there to cook with or just to make the soap with. Um, mostly to make the soap with. And I haven't had any problems with that going bad or freezing or doing anything stupid. So I think I'm back just to using cream for my milk for now, but that is, as always, subject to change. I actually did test some um, batches last year with some different milk mixes and the cream and the coconut are nearly identical in the texture that you get. The coconut you get a little, like an itty bitty tiny bit creamier, but with the cream you get super creamy with just a little bit bigger bubble, so either one works out. Okay, this is my fragrance. This is Amber Romance by the way. Mmm, just smells so soft and feminine. Yeah. Just use the whole bottle. This is a lightweight fragrance, it can handle a little extra. That's a great fragrance. I can smell it already. So once again, I want to go about halves these. So I guess I'm just going to actually go ahead and just weigh it this time. Let's take Katie White's advice here to scrape the bowl, which I always do. I uh, surprised to learn recently that's a pet peeve of hers. I thought that everybody scraped the bowl, but I guess I'm wrong. 
on that one. <laughs> um, tomorrow is equal. I just decided right now that I just want a little bit more white. Okay. No, no I don't because of the... Darn it, I can't make up my mind, can I? Let's see, that's 17.1. This one's 26. I'm going to pour 10 ounces into here. 5 ounces. 18, 19, 20. 23.5, 20, 1.2, 22.3, dollop more, yeah, call it even, okay. More TV in here. So that's my titanium dioxide. My amber romance will naturally discolor a little bit. And so I don't mind if this one stays completely white or if it darkens a little. But I just want to kind of separate it because I'm going to do another hanger swirl. But whereas the other one was kind of, um, like I'm going to do this one side by side instead of stacking one on top of the other. So. And this is that beautiful antique white again. I'm just going to add a little soap batter back into my TV. Stay around. I tell you, ever since I learned the trick about mixing the TV, it works. I've talked about it on my other videos about mixing it with hot water. If not, go back to um, go back to the Love Spell video, or you can check it out on Eden's Secret Channel about titanium dioxide. Okay, that's where I got this trick from. I tell you, it works. I don't have any more crackle. <laughs> So I want to kind of get ready to pour that. I'm sure that this has gotten thick yet. Yeah, that's what happens when you leave them to sit. That loosens it up just fine. Should have used the other end. Oh well. Okay. okay. Let's put this more or less in the middle. This on this side more or less in the middle. Shrink it down. Whoa. Brown's taking over. It's 
fine when it gets that. Now I'm totally blaming the fragrance oil on this one because I've made more than any other soap that I've made in the last year. I have made the palm free tons of times and it never thickens. So it's totally the fragrance oil. really quickly. Okay, so I'm going to go down. I'm going to come up back and forth really close together in like a figure eight kind of pattern because I'm kind of going for almost like a mantra swirl on this one. Well, I did my best to keep my soap area clean, but you know, I really only have about four feet to work in here, and I could really use about six or eight. Okay. That's another reason I like paper towels. They just, they work way better than newspapers for me. on the other side of the room. <laughs> She's a talker. She meows for no reason whatsoever. Just to be heard. I'm sure some of you guys have cats like that too, right? Here we go. Stacking that top again. I am so brave. <clears throat> Okay. Sounds a little bit too high for me, so I kind of want to bring these down a little bit. And bring that down a little bit. And then, there we go. Nicely textured top. Okay, so one last thing that I want to do to this one is add a little glitter if I can find my white glitter. I still don't like that top. You guys should shame me into not making the textured tops anymore. <laughs> don't do that, not really. I just think it's funny to say. That's a little much. 
but that's all right because it's really light colored. Ta-da! Sparkle, sparkle. All right, I'll see you guys next week for the cuts of these. Um, have a great night. Thanks for watching. If you haven't done so already, please comment, rate, and subscribe. Always enjoy sharing information and meeting new people. Have a great one. I'll see you next time. Bye!